five minutes Stafford trap recap. Oh, how many Stafford traps can I show in five minutes? Set a timer for five minutes. Okay, Stafford trap number one. The legendary Oh No My Queen. So all the traps are going to be from this position. Uh, this is like the first one to know. You take here, you say, Oh No My Queen. Someone call an ambulance. But not for me, because this is checkmate. Stafford trap number two. If they play e5 in this position, then you play knight e4, and then you you say he he he, and uh, then white will probably resign due to your evil laugh, but also due to the fact that I've triggered caps lock, and black's threatening f2, and if takes, takes king e2, eventually we're winning the queen. If takes the bishop, we take the queen. That's Stafford trap number two. Um, very similarly, if this, 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 we just transpose into the same thing. So that's Stafford trap number three, but uh, it's basically, yeah, it's the exact same thing. I'll show one more line here. If this, we take, we check, and here it takes, takes, we win material. Another cool trap after e5, the best move is d4, and then we play queen h4, threatening mate. And if white plays g3, which looks very normal, we take. And even though we lose a knight after it takes, there's this fork and black wins material. And this is also a pin, so white's already in big trouble here. Uh, was that four traps? I think that was four traps. So now let's look at traps where white plays knight c3. And there's a ton of traps after this move. We continue with this. Uh, most common trap that I think so many people fall for including many strong grandmasters, is knight g4. And this is already preferable for black. Uh, the only way to really try and defend f2 is bishop e3, but then after takes, 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 black won back the pawn and has a great position. Uh, what else? Yeah, bishop bishop c4 is another like really common trap. And then we play knight g4. And... This is already like terrible for white. A lot of players castle here. And then queen h4, hitting f2. And yeah, most people play h3. Over 21,000 people. And then we take. And then queen f3. And then we take with double check. And then king here or here. Then check again. And then checkmate. So over 2,300 games with this position. Uh, have I had this with black? I've had this exact game six times with black. So much fun. Alternatively, white can play queen f3 here, but then knight e5 is a super strong move. Attacking, attacking, and defending. And then after queen e2, there's queen h4, uh, setting up a really nice pin against f-pawn, um, creating a situation where the queen is overworked, and now we're threatening to take and then take, or take, take, and then take. And if g3, there's queen here. And then bishop here is coming with invasion against f3. And if d3, there's bishop g4. And this is just really bad for white. Like queen f1, I've had twice. And then take, take, and castle with a really nice position for black. Uh, going back, I can show my favorite trap, which is bishop e2. And there's different variations. Um, which can kind of transpose, like bishop e2 or h3 can lead to the same thing. But essentially we play h5, preparing this, and after h3, queen d4, and after castling knight g4, and this is already winning for black, because uh, there's massive uh, pressure against f2, and if white takes, takes, black's threatening queen e5 with forced mate. Like if d3, black is mating in three more moves, uh, g3, there's queen g3 checkmate. F pawn is pinned. So white's best try is to play g3 here. But after g3, there's queen e5, king g2, and another piece sacrifice. Bishop takes f2. Oh no, my bishop. So black sacrificed two pieces. But after rook f2, queen h5, uh, there's really no stopping the eventual checkmate. Um, like if rook f4, there's this, 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 and rook h1 is coming. And the funny line is if king takes f2, then rook h2, king e3, queen g3, and even though black is still down two pieces, 
Uh, this is just really, really fun for black. And that's my five minute timer. It says done. Oh, there was one I missed. I forgot to show the, oh, let me include one more bonus trap. We're going a little bit over time, but there's a cool trap that um, should be included. And this is one that I've trapped Nemo with. I've also trapped a, a handful of title players with is Bishop E3 takes, takes Knight G4 hitting the pawn, Queen F3 and then Queen G5 hitting the pawn again. The only way to defend the pawn is with the king. After king d2, there's really cool move knight h2. I've had this, yeah, five times. And after rook h2, which is uh, actually a blunder, then queen e5. And this is winning uh, a rook for, for black. And although we sacked the knight, uh, black's going to be up to exchange. Like rook h5, we take. And black is, um, yeah, pretty much winning according to the engine. Okay, so that's the bonus trap. Uh, I hope people are satisfied.